Aquí más de nuevo, estamos otra vez en Batman, The Enemy Within The Telltale Series. En el episodio anterior nos enfrentamos al Enigma, o también llamado El Acertijo. O sea, como sea, en este episodio vamos a enfrentarnos, bueno, no tanto enfrentarnos, pero sí que vamos a conocer al resto de su pandilla. Así que bueno, vamos a ver qué es lo que pasa. There's a million more efficient ways of contacting him, but you do it like this. Symbols are important, just like principles. Pero bueno, llegar llego. Así que. You two are acting almost friendly. It's a strange sight. Bad man. About time. Gordon, you're dismissed. This is still my goddamn station house. He's forgetting I'm the one who can make or break his career right now. You only remind me every other minute. Clearly, I need a better method of getting the message across. You're both behaving like children. Watch your tone, Batman. Oh, ho, ho, eh? Or what? You'll put him on timeout? I've been lenient with you so far, but don't push me. She's got some kind of leverage on you, doesn't she? If she's jammed you up somehow, just say the word. I'll appeal to the mayor, the governor, whatever it takes to get her off your back. I'll do whatever I can to help you. Jim, listen to me. I need you to let me handle this. I've still got your back, no matter what. Bueno, está yendo más o menos bien, eh, en general. Just supposed to come to Gotham, put the chains on Riddler and his gang, and get the hell out. I'm just saying this city gets under your skin fast. Know what I mean? Sí, no, desde luego que lo sé. Plans and all that. Even so, it's good that you and your people are here. Thanks. I guess you. Vamos a intentar mimar a Waller porque, por el contrario, puede salir esto muy mal, eh. She fought to get on this assignment, you know. Wanted to see her old neighborhood. Wanted to see you, her hometown hero. She wanted to impress you. She admires what you do for the people of this city. Your respect is important to her. She certainly succeeded on that front. She's one of my best. Still, wouldn't impress you. It's the same thing that made her move too fast on Riddler. Now there's a lesson learned. My lab techs were able to replicate a dose of the venom serum from the vial Bane left behind at the police arsenal. But with a twist, it's actually a counter agent. O sea, que el veneno cuál es? Porque se supone que es el antídoto. Ah, vale, que el antídoto es lo que tengo contra Bane. Leaving him weak and exhausted. Eh, efectivamente, vale. Could be useful. So, Wayne Enterprises. Sí, efectivamente. Heard you made some new Y sí, efectivamente. You're having me followed. Thanks to you, these very bad people have an EMP and a key that'll open every lock I would want to keep bolted shut. They're clearly planning something. Mistakes are too high to leave anything to chance. You know, I actually considered asking you to infiltrate Riddler's gang. Before everything blew up, I knew I could count on you to get me close to them. Close to Bane. You're good at this. Seems like you've already won Harley Quinn's trust. What you saw was just a test. An operation like theirs requires someone with your resources. As long as you don't blow it, they're gonna want to keep Bruce Wayne around until they take him for all they can. Get them away from their base of operations. Somewhere they'll be exposed. When they're all together, out in the open, contact me. I'll be standing by. Ready to ambush. Pero qué equipo tiene esta? Take them down when they're at their most vulnerable. Algo insuperable, okay. Y con equipo me refiero a batallón, ¿no? Count me in. That's it. No extra demands. I'll contact your people when I need them to strike. Batman. If it gets bad for you, just remember, we're out here. When you're in deep like this, you need friends. 
Let's say everything goes pear-shaped, and you get stuck in there longer than you'd like. Then what's right, what's wrong, it all gets blurry. And guess what? That's okay. Because you're going to have to do some blurry things that you are not Durbius. before this is done. You hear me? That's just how these kinds of operations go down. I created Batman to strike fear into criminals, not become one. Batman's not the one rubbing shoulders with him at the moment. You should think about which one Gotham really needs right now. Excepto en la esquina de Finger y 10. Bueno, y ya está, se me ha quitado. No me ha dejado leer más. Be in and out, Alfred. Just long enough to figure out their plans. Good luck, Bruce. Stay safe. O sea que vamos ahora a la parte complicada, ¿no? Ahora es cuando tenemos que ponernos muy tensos porque puede salir todo muy mal. Y estas pintas, tío. Here we go. Hey now! Welcome to our little hideaway and home away from home. The end of the line. Welcome, Bruce. We're happy to have you. Thanks, John. You said you'd kill him after you got what you needed. So what? Ain't a girl allowed to change her mind? Could someone get me out of these handcuffs, please? Tell bueno, bueno, bueno. I shouldn't kill you. <laughs> well, it seems like the Prince of Gotham is more like an empty suit. Eso no parece que le haya gustado mucho, eh. I bring us back the transport and the arms we required. You, you bring back a worthless aristocrat. We don't need his money. We have what we need to finish this. Thanks to me. He ain't worthless, you overgrown bicep. He already got us an EMP device and the failing scheme. I'll betcha I can find a use for him. I do not care how much these two swoon over you, Wayne. We don't want you here. Hay tres niveles de confianza. Está el de John Doe, el de Harley Quinn y el de Wayne, ¿sabes? En ese orden. Whoopsie. What the hell? Turn it off! Turn it off! Now! Can you do something about this? It's freezing. What have you done? Bueno, 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 bueno. You need to uncuff me. Don't screw this up. Veremos qué nivel de confianza es el de Freeze. I can turn it off. Make it stop. Or I will seal you both in ice. I swear, if you don't get that electricity back on immediately, I'll send you to a frozen hell. Ah, no, espérate. Este va en verde. Este va en verde. Y este va en rojo. Vale, ¿y este? Eh... ¿Coincidencia con el primer esquema? Ah, vale, vale, vale. ¿Y ahora este? Vale, perfecto. Y ahora, este en rojo. Este en rojo. Y este. Y por último, este de aquí. Ah, no, no. Y este en verde, perdón. Efectivamente, vale. A ver, tan complicado no era. Bueno, al menos sabemos que funciona. I must check on Nora. See how she is. Ah, claro, Nora es su esposa. You may have impressed these two, but I haven't made up my mind about crushing your skull. Fair enough. Es que menudo sitio nos hemos metido, eh. There's still a lot to get done. Who put you in charge? Somebody has to give the orders. That was a nice job before. Come on up to my office. No intentará ligar conmigo otra vez, ¿no? Vamos, espero que no. Listen, Bruce. I just wanna 
clear the air a little. You distanced yourself from us back at your office. I don't blame you, after all the trouble I caused. You probably noticed I like to stir things up. It's a bad habit, and, well, it's made me more enemies than friends. I want to say I'm sorry for messing with your people. Your employees, I know they probably mean a lot to you. Thank you, Harley. Your apology means a lot. Really? You probably think I'm a terrible person, but I want you to understand. You've seen these animals I work with. In my business, you let your guard down for a second, you get torn to shreds. I can only imagine. If I'm always pushing buttons, it's to keep people off balance, you know? Keep them guessing my next move. Keep the real me hidden. I hope you ain't gonna judge me for it. To be honest, I haven't had it so long I don't even notice I'm doing it. It's just a part of who I am. Sounds shady to me. I prefer a more straightforward approach to dealing with my colleagues. We ain't dealing with just any old regular type colleagues here jawing over the water cooler. But I get your meaning. You ain't like these others. Bane's a powder keg. Freeze. <laughs> well, you saw Freeze. John's sweet. And believe me, he's got heaps of potential. But he's still a growing boy. You, though, you got your head screwed on right. You're reasonable. I can work with reasonable. We're pulling a job tonight. I want you to be a part of it. You already showed you know how to use that EMP better than any of these other clowns. A job? Sounds intriguing. What's the target? I like you, Brucey, but I never give up all my secrets on a first date. It's need to know. And you don't need to know. Ajá. Bueno, yo lo he intentado, pero bueno. Using that EMP, though, that's gonna make tonight's job a whole lot less messy. And that no-neck asshat Bane, he loves making a mess. <laughs> People getting killed just makes his day. If you're gonna come with, you gotta convince the others. Convince them? It's a real pain in the ass sometimes, but you need a majority opinion for anything big. And bringing you along, well, you got some persuading to do. Let me know how I can help. Vale. So what's the deal with Freeze? He's unique. You mean why he's blue and wrapped up in machinery? Accident in the lab. Here's the thing about Freeze. Only thing he gives two hoots about is his wife. O sea, Nora. He gave up everything to try and save her when she got sick. And I mean everything. No, this the regular job, health, soul, the whole shebang. She's dead. Frozen stiff. Keeps her on ice in the next room while he searches for a cure. Ain't that just kooky? I mean, that explains why he flipped when the EMP went off. But seriously, who does that? I doubt his wife would approve if she realized what he's become. She'd probably never want to wake up, exactly. So he'd be better off not getting what he wants. You can say that again, but he might not want to hear it. Talking about his wife is the only way to get Freeze to pay attention to you. But watch yourself. His attention ain't always a good thing. Ajá, es bueno saberlo. I get the feeling Bane doesn't like me very much. That knucklehead respects strength and loyalty. Show him you got those, and he'll come around. He's a man's man. I don't got much time for all that burly machismo, but sit him down for a beer or something. He'll hear what you gotta say. He may kill you when you're done, but at least he'll listen. Ya está, ¿no? Eso era todo. Eh, ¿Y ahora qué hago? Ah, pues nada, ya... Ya he hecho todo. Pues voy a hablar con frío. O oh, creo que se llama frío. Spirit of unity. Not really what I'm sensing from this group. Desde luego. Venga, vamos.
Podemos hablar con frío, ¿no? Es que no sé si decirle frío Vamos a decirle frío y ya está Aunque no estoy yo muy seguro de qué es lo que vamos a hablar con él, ¿no? Pero en teoría... El señor Freeze Le ponen puesto... O sea, le tienen puesto aquí, vale Pues vamos a decirle al señor Freeze Y... Supongo que ya está Aunque puedo mirar el mapa este, ¿no? A lo mejor tienen marcado algo de información interesante Hombre, claro Pues vamos a hablar con Freeze I heard about your wife And I... Kill me out. I might be able to help. What do you mean? You'll answer me if you're smart and understand the concept of self-preservation. I know pain. What it's like. No, no, no es la frase que yo quería usar. I can't imagine anyone knowing anything like what I've experienced. Es que no quiero que piense que, que, que yo pienso que su mujer está muerta, ¿sabes? Pero oye, mira, ha salido mejor. O sea, mejor de lo que esperaba. Big ones. You could house and protect her. Continue your research to cure her. Why? Why would you do this? It's what I do for my friends. I don't have friends. Bueno, 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 bueno. It's what I do for my people. How very vague. I almost fell for it. You don't care about mine, Nora. You only care about yourself. An empty suit. Sooner you're gone, the better. Pues parece que no lo he convencido, ¿eh? Casi, pero no. No tendría que haber utilizado la de los amigos, sino la de yo te ayudo a ti y tú me ayudas a mí, ¿sabes? No sé. Bueno, vamos a intentarlo con Bane. A ver si así al menos, yo qué sé. Lo primero no se ha ido demasiado bien, pero bueno. Laboratorio es Venom. Oye, por cierto, ahora que se ha ido Freeze A lo mejor podríamos echar un vistazo al mapa, ¿no? Y si no, pues volvemos y hablamos directamente con Bane Pero no sé Vamos a echar un vistazo A ver si aparece al menos el, el localizador para pulsarlo Y no, efectivamente no Bueno, pues vamos a mirar esto Bueno, no era mi intención Porque quería mirar lo otro Pero da igual, se ha bajado Así que vamos a hablar directamente con Bane Y ya está Venga, perfecto, hablemos. I was hoping to get another chance to speak with you. Thirsty work. My throat is dry. Fetch Wayne. Que le traigo una cerveza, ¿no? Pues a ver dónde encuentro una cerveza. A lo mejor ellos lo saben, ¿no? ¿Qué, qué está pasando? ¿Por qué han dado de repente así? Bueno, pues nada. ¿Y esto aquí? EMP shielding. This material will keep whatever it's insulating from being affected by the EMP blast. Vale, bueno, es bueno saber que ellos se van a proteger de, de la ráfaga. Vale, vamos a por una cerveza. A lo mejor aquí. Aquí está John, por cierto. Pues nada, chicos y chicas, esto ha sido todo. Espero que os haya gustado. Si os ha gustado, hacedmelo saber. Y de verdad que espero que os esté gustando este episodio tanto como a mí, porque la verdad es que está molando un montón. Así que bueno, sea como sea, un saludo y adiós. <risa>